Hello, thanks for joining us. Today's question comes from a gentleman who called us and wanted to ask the question about being afraid of heights in a hot air balloon. This is not an uncommon question. We get this question all the time and I try to explain to people how it feels in a hot air balloon and this is probably the best way that I can explain to the people that are thinking about going for a ride in a hot air balloon and whether or not they will be afraid of heights. Well, typically my answer to them is no, you're not gonna be afraid of heights in a hot air balloon. And that comes to a big surprise to most people. And I've been flying for almost 40 years now and taken hundreds of people for rides in a balloon. And very few people are afraid of heights. Yes, they're a little bit nervous when they first start out because it's the fear of the unknown. They get in a hot air balloon and they start to fly and then they're really apprehensive of what actually is going to happen. But here's what actually happens. When we fly in a hot air balloon, we fly at very low speeds, typically in winds less than 10 miles an hour. So you're moving very slow. You're in a very stable platform. This is another reason why hot air ballooning is really great for photography and it's a very calm and relaxing flight. But with that said, the hot air balloon basket is typically very high. Normally it's up almost to your chest level, um, depending on how tall you are. So you're very secure in this basket. But the one reason why I feel that you're not afraid of heights is because you have no concept of the ground. You have no connection uh, for as far as depth control or depth perception. When you climb a tree and you get up in the top of a tree or on a limb, or maybe even climb a ladder and just get a few steps in the air, your knees might be banging and you're just really afraid of heights. Even if maybe you're not afraid of heights, when you start to climb, uh, you have that real depth perception. You can actually see how high you are up off the ground. But in a hot air balloon, you don't have that. You have no connection to the ground. So when you start to climb and you get a little bit of elevation in a balloon, um, you just don't have that depth perception. So you don't have that feeling of height. So, you know, the first two or three minutes, your mind is saying, I'm going to be afraid, I'm going to be afraid, because you have been afraid in the past of heights, but now you can actually see, and once you see, uh, your brain sees that you're really not in any danger or any fear, um, you start to relax, and then the next hour is just pure enjoyment where you can just go ahead and have a romantic flight with uh, the person that's taking you for the ride or just go ahead and take pictures and enjoy the trip. So I hope that answers your question. Typically, no, you don't get the fear of heights when you're flying in a hot air balloon. Thanks for joining us this time, and I hope that you uh, have an opportunity to watch future videos. My name is Ted Gothier with FlyBalloons.net.